3 o'clock in the morning. I had gotten up to go to the bathroom and I heard a pop and a snap and apparently my leg, my femur had broken. And they had to break into my home and got me to the hospital and took me to Shady Grove. And then in November, I had to end up in the emergency room again. And I thought it was a pinched nerve with muscle spasms. I went for the MRI and they told me I would find out in 48 hours. No, it was three hours later. We are bringing state-of-the-art neurosurgical treatment to our patients in our community at Adventist Healthcare. Majority of patients with systemic cancers can have metastatic tumors that migrate to the brain and affects patients' neurological condition. We are bringing multiple subspecialists, including oncologists, neurosurgeons, radiation specialists, to work together to um, create a team approach for our patients. Dr. Amini and his team stayed there, um, repaired the, the fracture, and got all of the tumor. I, I just thank God for Dr. Amini and his team. We are focused to develop both spinal and brain specialties to enable our patients to be treated locally rather than traveling long distances to other cities. As a neurosurgeon, I often worry about my patient's uh, recovery outside the hospital. We have a multi-specialty team and different facilities that provide care at different stage of their treatment. I'm able to communicate with them and know exactly the type of treatments and recovery they have. We're the only specialized comprehensive rehabilitation facility in Montgomery County. We're also a part of a system of care which enables us to provide highly specialized, well-coordinated care to each person that we serve. This ensures the best outcomes. Great people over there. It was wonderful. I, I, I know you're, hard, you're sick, you're recovering from surgery, but wonderful people. I have gone through radiation um, for both my leg and my back. I had all my treatments over at the Aquilina Center, which is a beautiful center, but the nurses are top notch. And you make friends in there and you find support with others that you're getting infusions with. They have programs, they have the nurse navigators, they have nutritionists. There are so many people there available to you to help you through this process and that you're not alone in this. I have friends in Boston and they've all asked me to come home and that they'll take great care of me. But to be honest, I don't think I could receive any better care than I am receiving here. They were all compassionate. My writing of the book is to show people hope and where it is in your day to day. My blood tumor markers are now down to close to normal ranges. There's no new lesions, I, it, it's all good. They all helped me through this with kindness and great humor.